Hello everyone. In this video, you are going to learn about some uh, string functions in Tableau. So first, I will drag product ID into the row shelf. So here you can see some product IDs are starts with the letters F U R, which indicates that furniture category, and some are uh, O F F, which indicates that office supplies category, and some are T E C, which indicates that these are from a uh, technology category. So uh, let me create a calculated field. and uh, i will name it as search for text so click on this drop down and click on string so these are all built in fun string functions that are available in tableau to use in uh, string manipulation so first i will use a contains function so which will return true if the string contains the substring so let me use this function so this is the syntax that i am going to use string comma contains string comma substring so as a string i am going to give the dimension name or a field name product id comma i will give the substring as a tc so this calculation is going to return true if the string contains the substring so click on okay and you can see in the data pane a new calculator field is created with the icon true or false so it will return the boolean value true or false so wherever the substring is exists in the string then it will return true otherwise it will return the boolean value false for the remaining members so let me edit this calculation and uh, i will use the starts with function so which will returns true if the string starts with the substring so i will use the substring as if you are so click on okay so this calculation will return true wherever the string starts with the substring if you are so otherwise it will returns false for the remaining okay so let me edit this calculation and now i will use uh, the function find let me rename it as find so this function returns the position of a substring within a string or a zero if the substring is not found so i will just give ac so the first character in the string is position 1 and the second character is position 2 third character is position 3 and the fourth character this is hyphen 5 which which is a position of the letter a which we have given in the substring so this calculation is going to return 5 so click on okay so you can see it returns 5 where the substring starts in the string so this is a position of the substring starts in the string so for the remaining it will returns 0 because uh, the substring which we have given doesn't exists in the string okay thanks for watching please do subscribe and uh, like this video